Welcome back one and all to Trails of Cold Steel. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time, we arrived in Legram. My turn. Laura's hometown. Yes, sir. We have Milliam, it's my turn. Emma with us, as well as Gaius and Eusis. Go! This time. Oh my god. We need to go to the Bracer Guild headquarters. We saw the blonde Bracer again. We haven't met with him yet. Hello, nice maid lady. Wrong button. Wrong button again. Cross inside a circle. Any idea what it means? No one really knows for sure. There are a number of theories, though. Unfortunately, the meanings of most animus symbols have been lost over time. That's a Celtic cross. The Celtics, before converting to Christianity, worshipped the sun god. The church taught them hmm. that it was a mistake and you worshipped the Son of God, which is why on a Celtic cross, you see a circle on it to symbolize the Son. The Catholic Church adopt, adopted many pagan traditions into their own religion to help converts feel more comfortable, such as the Son on a cross and a Celtic symbol. This building is the Legrand branch of the Bracer Guild. Neat. Knock, knock. Oh, the guild emblem. Must not have noticed it earlier in all the mist. Strange. The branches in the capital were closed due to political pressure, but this one still seems active. The Legrand branch continues to operate as it always has. That's why I was rather surprised to find out that the capital branches were no longer active. Can think of it. We met a bracer back when we were in Berehard for our field study, but I saw no signs of a guild branch there either. It closed down a year ago. Though as I understand it, the pressure to close came from the Duke's household, not the Imperial government. Is that so? Well, bracers are an eyesore to most of those well-to-do types. Thank you, Milliam. They don't bow to authority. You can't bribe them with Mira. They're all about protecting civilians. Interesting for a mercenary faction. Give them any excuse to lean on the bracers to get them out, at, to get them out of the picture. And that's exactly what they're gonna do. Melium, that's kind of. You don't mince words, do you? Hmm. Choice words coming from an intellectual de intelligence division operative, do you think you're not complacent in this? Well, it's less of us and more gramps. We went bar barging into the branches in the capital himself. He, uh, uh, bah, bah, bah. he went barging into the branches in the capital himself and started telling them what they could and couldn't do. Wow. That explains Sarah's frosty temperament towards them. That's kind of a contradictive statement. Man, you guys sure know how to poke a guy where it hurts, don't you? This guy. Toval. Oh, you know each other. Nah, we just ran into each other a couple months ago. Long time no see, Laura. Sounds like Sarah's keeping your nose to the grindstone, eh? Wait, so... You must be the former associate of our instructor, I take it. Ready much. Tobol. I'm Tobol... Rendur, a bracer... with the guild here in the Empire. Good to meet you, ladies and gentlemen of Class 7.
wait a minute. So was it a coincidence that we ran into you in Berea Hard? Bingo! Sarah told me you were going to be there. She wanted me to keep an eye out for you and step in if I thought you were in a real tight spot. But she insisted I'd play casual and not give myself away. Man, the part was a lot harder than I thought it'd be. I had no idea. Thank you so much for your assistance back then. Yeah, we wouldn't have been able to bust Machias out without your help. You may not have directly assisted me, but I suppose you have my thanks nonetheless. Ha! <laughs> You're welcome. Sarah's repaid the debt in full, though, so don't even worry about it. Interesting. I had no idea that you'd met, already met some of the members of our class. Incidentally, Tobol, the guild standing here in Erebonia certainly seems to have shifted over the past two years. Hmm. No doubt, basically every branch here in the Empire was shut down after the government started pressuring, started putting pressure on us. There's a slight tick there. Seems to be fine though. Some of us found work in different fields, like Laura. Others transferred to branches outside the country. Yeah, it's fine. But we all agreed to get back together if we can ever resume operations in Erebonia again. Until then, we're just trying to keep low. Scraping out a living for ourselves. Sounds like a difficult life. Still, with the guild having to decrease its presence, isn't there more than enough work for the remaining branches? <laughs> I wish. The RMP deals with a lot of stuff we wouldn't have handled before. Your little lady in particular keeps herself pretty busy. Oh, you mean Claire. Yep, she sure is a hard worker. Although, with all the time she spends at on work, it's no wonder she doesn't have a boyfriend. <laughs> Milliam, I'm not sure you should go around sharing the details of people's private lives without their consent. <laughs> Her face. Sarah looks... Sarah. Emma looks so irritated. Just look at that. That is funny. <laughs> well, I had enough work to keep the lights on anyway. And this branch is the Vice Count's approval, so we can display our sign without getting in any trouble. So that's how it is. Well, it's nice to hear that the Vice Count seems pretty supportive of the Guild. He seems to find much of himself in the Bracer's way of life. Self-reliance, pride, a focus on helping others. Bracers are basically Minutemen. He's long said that if he were free of other responsibilities, he would join the guild and work as a bracer himself. Oh my, that seems very... I hardly think a man who owns territory in the Empire could just up and join the bracers. The Radiant Blade Master himself as a bracer, huh? In terms of strength and standing, he's probably on par with Cassius Bright. I'll bet he'd make S rank right on the spot. You know Cassius Bright? I believe he's a current he's currently a brigadier general in the Liberal in the Rivlian Army, as well as a bearer of the title the Divine Blade. Uh, that's a reference to Trails of the Sky, a game I have not played, though it exists within the same universe. That the Berlian army, that country they're mentioning is Erebonia's southern neighbor. Huh, I guess I should expect no less from a member of the Intelligence Division. Anyway, that's how the Vice Count ended up asking me to sort out some tasks for your field study. Training, okay. The highway monster, okay. And make the light work, okay. We got some busy work.
I'm serious, Milliam's portrait looks adorable. Well, the store's right here. Accessories and healing items. I've already stocked up. Oh my god. You're the one I need to talk to. You're the one who sells weapons, okay. Road lamps. Replace a light. Okay. Seems pretty simple. Lights. A01, 5, B01, and 9. Ooh, there's a lot of marks. Okay, I should be able to. They should just be on the map, I hope. Especially since they only showed me four. Yes, there are new weapons, but I don't have any money. So hopefully there's some monsters I can grind up some Mira on. A lot of money on. This is clearly a very Scottish-inspired area. You've got a wharf here? We do. A ferry makes trips between here and the opposite shore. If you crossed the lake, you'd be in the Sutherland province, right? That's what I'm looking for, the highway. spots around where I need to change light bulbs. So let's get right on that. Fog lights. Well, let's do it. Also monsters, because I need grinding. Like I said, the battles get a little old, so I'm just going to be skipping them. That went well. It feels almost... magical. I know. Like, if you just wait long enough, you might see a fairy or something.
Another one down. Okay, that was well enough. That was a little annoying, not gonna lie. Oh, we have a big thing. Ooh, that one looks tough. Oh, it's one of the stun locking things. Ooh, that one looks tough. Two of the stun locking things. Well, you know what? I say fuck the lot of you. Behold, my most powerful strike! Radiant Blade Dance! Flames, scabble on my blade! Time to feel off that! Oh, there seems to be a treasure chest here. And your face seems to be missing from that box. Oh, a treasure chest. Thank you, Yusus. Yay, treasure! Oh my god, everybody, I get it. There's a frickin' treasure chest. Now, I gotta get those combat points back up. Die already. <laughs> Not bad. Laura got a level up. <laughs> I did it! Mil so did Milliam. <laughs> oh shit! I did it! Green got a level up. I seem to have missed a monster. I'll be back. Brave, level four. La Fortune. La Forte. La, la, la. However you pronounce that. Oh, and strength up for four turns by 25%. And... Once per fight. Increased... Ooh. Strength for four turns when health is below 20%. Making That's progress! Also, Emma got a level up. Now, before anyone gets any ideas, I also think Emma's adorable. Go right first. Oh, the tree comes through here. Yep. That's the Ebel Branch line, the same line we traveled here on. There it is. Halfway there. Oh, these little bastards again.
That should suffice. Use has gained a level? Just getting started. Gaius gained a level. Now there's a light here. And there's treasure around the corner. Well, you know me and treasure. Gotta go, gotta go get it. Even if it isn't be guarded. Oh god, devil point thing! Oh god, the fog is thick! What the fuck? That went well. There seems to be a treasure chest here. There's also a trapped treasure chest here. Let's go, Lenny! Yes, sir! Well, okay. You already have a barrier up. Let's just go for the buster arm. Get him! Now! Got it! Go! Alright, let's do step. this! Leave it to me! Right! Uh, okay. On everyone. Uh, yeah. Oh, Moon, shield us from harm. Crescent shell. Not too bad. Going. But no levels. Kind of disappointed, but take what you can get. An abyss shadow. What the hell is that? Increases speed. Well, I know who's getting that. more things to grab and more monsters to kill. Another one of the big things. This monster seems dangerous. Be careful. I've killed one before. I can kill another one. So don't don't stress it too bad. Well, here, Usus and Gaius are falling behind in level, so let's bring Usus into the fold. My turn. My turn. Yeah, I've got this. Two monsters to the south. I'm gonna go kill them. Ha! Ha! Annoying little fuckers. <laughs> I've only just begun. Thor got a level up in that fight.
Mirage at level 4. Crescent Mirror. And killing enemies restores EP. 50% chance can counter evade magic. Interesting. Okay. You're not too far ahead yet, Laura. Soon you're going to switch out for Gaius. The reason I'm not switching out Emma is because it's always good to have a healer. Right now, my only healer is Laura. Is Emma, excuse me. the boss. It's a alligator shark thing. I want users in for this. A worthy adversary. Go! There's two of them. Alright, let's do this! Understood. Understood. My turn. Okay, that I've learned is just going to be redundant. Or will it? I don't know. Now is our chance. Don't let it pass. Right. Leave it to me. Oh no, that is not redundant yeah. so long as Rain goes first. Okay, good. Oh Moon, shield us from harm. Crescent shot. Right, just set up. My turn. Shatter! Oh god, how many turns are these things gonna get? Oh boy. My turn. Stunlocking yeah. boss! Oh boy. Arcus, activate! Right! Behold, my most powerful strike! Radiant Blade Dance! Jesus! I really hate stun locking enemies. I really fucking hate stun locking enemies. Arcus, activate! I'm sorry, everyone. Okay! Arcus, activate! Possible. Yeah. Thanks. In fact, the <laughs> boss is go. Oh my God. I'm sorry, everyone. Ah. Right. Shatter. I can do this. Hear me. 
suppose I should thank you. Oh, that's not annoying. Impossible. Is it strong enough? This isn't looking good. Okay, I just need a fresh start. I'm sorry, everyone. Now I just got a text message or something. Yes. Okay, I need to go check something real quick, and I'll be right back. Might actually be a challenge. Good. My turn. All right, let's do this. Leave it to me. Very well. Very Zero well. Arts. I don't normally do this, but... Huh. You don't normally get it's a start out like that. Oh, Moon, shield us from harm. Crescent Gem. Of course. My turn. Let's go for it. Freeze, nice. This. Uh, how about you? No. You're a golden spear, though. Ha. Yeah. Flames, gavel on my plate. I'll handle this. Here. That's more like it. Try not to overexert yourself. <laughs> Don't worry about me. And I think just everyone got a level up there. Damn, Laura almost got two levels from that. Aegis, level four. Okay. Adamantine shield. Immunity reflect when HP is low once we fight below. Ooh, nice. I did it! Rain that got a level. Use this got a level. Progress. Emma got a level. <laughs> I did it! William nice. got a level. And Gaius got a level. Levels for everybody! Okay. What? Okay, good. It's not taking me back to the town yet, and I'm not ready to go back to town. Not bad. Laura got a level in that endeavor.
One more lamp. What's up here, though? Okay, apparently I'm not going that way just yet. Back to town. Oh, some monsters respawned. Good, that's more experience, more grinding fodder. Ooh, that one looks tough. <laughs> nice. Guys, somehow got a level from that, but I'm not gonna complain. I like the fact that your allies, team parties, whatever, get level rather they fight or not. Cause Bring it on! Yeah, that's actually really good. I like the fact that carries over. Next, I gotta go to the training hall and the store. Let's go turn in the store real quick. Crystal Flood. Let's look at that in a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh my god. Hold on. We're going to turn all of that in. I may grow to regret this, but... Hold on. Let's not go crazy now. Let's do 1,500 of each. Back to exchange.
That'd be good for Gaius. Well, that's all I'm gonna do for now, apparently. I can sell my weapons, hold on. Let's wait a little longer before we can customize the rest of those weapons. Oh shit, I've been going for an hour. Uh, well, I'm getting in this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Trails of Cold Steel as I turn in these quests and go see what else is in store for me. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off. <laughs>